Hello, everybody. So this is Icarus. It's the third game that we're going to play on the third series. We're going to start on the channel here. Uh, a buddy of mine told me about this game. I haven't really done much research or anything. I haven't really looked at any videos. Playing is pretty much blind. But he told me that at one point you had to play missions. So you, it wasn't like a persistent open world type game. You just had to just do mission after mission after mission and start over every time. Now he says there's an open world aspect to it. So that's what we're going to get into, where we can just play a persistent open world solo. Uh, it is a multiplayer game. You can't play with other people. We're just going to play solo. And uh, we're going to check this out and see how it goes. You know, if you guys like it, we'll keep playing it. So just let me know. And uh, we'll get started. Oh, other thing is I don't actually know. If you go in here to the settings, the video settings, it doesn't actually tell you the screen resolution. So I did set everything to Epic, uh, the highest quality, DLSS is on quality, uh, sharpness I turned it all the way up. Uh, you get the idea though, but it doesn't actually tell you what resolution is, so I don't know what resolution the game is in, which is pretty messed up, but uh, there it is. So here we go, guys. Oh, we gotta do a data migration here. Okay, looks like we gotta make a character. So we definitely wanna be a guy. Hmm. Oh, so I think we'll go with that gray like we normally do for the channel. I didn't know they had voices, I don't really care. Let's see. No scars, facial hair, we'll give him a goatee because I have one. And, uh, no tattoos. Again. That's about the best we're going to get. Clothing, we don't care. Cap style, do we? Let's turn the cap off. Guess not. All right, and of course it's gonna be Zazzle. It be all caps. Apparently it has to be all caps. Okay. That was gray, not blue. Okay, open world mission or outpost. Load, join. We haven't done anything. We haven't played before. So we're just going to click here and open world. Yep. Okay, we got Olympus, the original region. Open for prospecting. Olympus feels familiar with its lush forests, scorched deserts, and frozen tundras. But time spent exploring will reveal just how different it really is. Establish your claim where the entire story began. Centered around a bra braided river, Styx is a previously off-limits area of Icarus with reports of unnatural growth rates and mutations in the planet's wildlife. Balance risk with reward across arid, freezing, and deceivingly pleasant climates, but we wanted to first overcome the dangers. I think we'll go with the new map. I don't know how many of you guys have played this before. I don't know whether you like this game or not. I just know that my buddy raves about it and talks about how great it is, so we're going to try it out. But if you have played it before, you probably played the other map. Maybe this will be new for you. Great new open world. Oh. Easy, crazy. Creature melee damage, creature health. Yeah, we don't like easy. We don't really want hardy. We'll go with medium. Enter prospecting. Is it valid or already in use? Really, Zazzle's new home is already in use? Okay, apparently. Apparently, it didn't like the period. Select an Enviro suit and load equipment onto your dropship for your next mission. One oxygen slots in suit. Turbo. Uh, 
Bernard Slosh and Surrey Adams can be reclaimed after five days from prospects if they are not returned on a drop ship. Yeah, I don't seem to have anything to select, so as far as I can tell, I just got my Enviro suit. Okay, where do we want to start at here? They don't tell you anything about them, I guess. That looks like it's all snow. That looks like a desert. That looks like a lush land with rivers all the way through it. That's probably the way to go. Here's a little small lake. Bunch of snow around it, though. Hmm. That's kind of tempting, honestly. And there's another desert area down here. We'll start here, though. Just oh, okay. It does tell you something. Comfortable, a temperate of the drop zone. Waters are medium. Trees are high. War is high or medium. Of course, aggressive creatures are high. Food is medium. O2 is medium. You have to get oxygen somehow. Uh, rocks are high and passive creatures are medium. Hey, what's this one over here like? High aggressive drop. Huh. Low rocks, low trees, cold. Hot, low water, low oxygen. Yeah, let's just stick to our little green land here. Privacy type, private. All right, guys. Like I said, I'm completely new at this. So if I do something stupid, if you played this before and I do something stupid, please leave a comment. Let me know. Uh, if you have any tips or tricks for me, let me know. I could probably use all the help I can get on this. I really don't know the first thing about it. Uh, the only thing my buddy told me was dig into a rock and don't waste your points on stick houses. All right, that's like all he pretty much told me, or the only uh, thing he told me to start out at. He's like, just, just, uh, just go straight to wood buildings, whatever that means. Oh, this is looking like satisfactory already. Got a little drop pod dropping down to our alien planet. We're even la landing in the grass fields, aren't we? Game sound sound or game sound sounds a little high. So I don't know what it's gonna be like for you guys. I don't know what it's gonna be like once we get out here, though. Okay, can I dismantle my drop pod? The only way in, your only way out. Press F to interact. Looks like we can send stuff back up to the you ready to return it. No, I don't want to return yet. I just got here. Okay. Oh, uh, let's see. What's this? Oxite. Don't know what oxide is, but we'll take it. Got some stone. We'll take some stone. Uh, is there a map? There is a map. Okay. Got a big lake down here. Hmm. Wonder if like the water draws hostile creatures or not. I really don't know. Actually, do I have any equipment at all? O2 oxygen. Not gonna help me out and tell me anything, is it? Okay. Crafting. Need sticks and fiber. Sticks and fiber, some wood, some stone, ice and a thermos, okay. I'm definitely not in an area to get ice, am I? Uh, we got a tech tree here. Stone pile. Back and sort of wood. Stone axe. 
Okay, okay, so I guess we have all these. We have to unlock the rest of this. We have to unlock a campfire. Unlock a bedroll. Unlock a fire pit. If we have a campfire, why do we need a fire pit? Fire whacker. <laughs> okay. Uh, wooden spears. Stone knife. Bone spear. Bone knife. Bone sickle. Drying rack. Okay. This is all pretty basic, I guess. We got higher tiers here. Let's see. Let's just take out top tier here see what we can get. Fabricator who takes electronics. Okay. Flashlight. Alright, so we're getting electricity at some point. Titanium pickaxe. Now we're talking. Titanium axe. Titanium crossbow. Titanium bolt. Okay. Yeah, now we're talking. I'm guessing it's pro. Oh, requires level 30. Okay, yeah, we got a long way to go to get to 30. Alright, so it looks like we got some food here. Some kind of squash. Okay, we'll take that. Whoa, what just bleeded at me? I don't have anything to kill you with, man. It's too bad because I'm hungry. Uh, here's a stick. A lily. grabbing stuff so I can try to craft. How do I get fiber? Is that a carrot? That is a carrot. Okay. Why not? How do I get fiber there? Get it off of a tree or something? Harvest? Okay, yeah, I got some fiber from the tree there. And some more sticks. Gotcha. Alright, now. Get that. Need one, I think. We have enough to make this too. Okay. These are already equipped, aren't they? So, one is a pick. So, I go over here and smack his stone with it. Damn. Ooh, it needed the forms. This is what my buddy meant about make a hole in a stone and climb inside. Okay. We need to find a big rock to do that to. I wonder if we can do it over there. How do I. Okay, shift around apparently. Big rock. Not quite bigger. Okay, there's a big one. I bet I could get inside there. Okay. Can I just dig into the side of this wall? Apparently not. Okay. That's the biggest rock I've seen so far. That one's fairly big, too. Can I get in there, maybe? I can probably. Not very wide. Huh. Guess we'll just try it and see. So, how many of you guys have played this? I'm wondering. You know more about I. I'm sure if you played it at all, you know more about it than I do. Stamina depleted. I got stamina. Huh? Oh, bird flew over. <laughs> kind of creeped me out a little. How do I get in here? I have to like break this little edge off or something. There we go. Okay, I guess I do just have to make it wide enough, huh? Ooh, leveled up already. Alright. 
blueprint points three, talent points one. Okay. It's like getting this rock here. We'll check that out and figure out what that means. Damn it, a build up here. This is just a little rock outside. This is just our doorway. We still got to get the big rock. How do we get the talent? Ta okay, tech tree. I'm sure I'm going to want a campfire. I'm sure I'm going to want a bedroll. Respawn location. Yeah, definitely going to want a bedroll. I'm sure I'll die many times. Can I get this? Knife? Yeah, I kind of want a knife, don't I? Something to fight with, I guess. Maybe I could fight with the axe. I don't know. Or the pick. Do I need a fire wicker? I don't think I'm going to need a fire pit either. Bone knife. That's interesting. Bone spear. Bone sickle. Drying rack. I imagine I'm going to have to kill stuff for food, so we're probably going to want a drying rack. Wait, why can't I unlock that? Oh, I guess I'm out of points. I only used two, right? I said I had three. Okay, anyway. Talents, how many of these do I have? Does it say? I don't tell how many talent points I have. Okay, my oxygen's getting a little low. Food's getting a little low. Water's getting low. One point available, there we go. Alright, so increase wood from felling. Increase yield from harvesting by hand. Increase stone from mining. Increased inventory weight capacity. Ooh, that's pretty nice. I guess the stone's heavy. Increase health. Increase movement speed. Movement speed's always good, right? Increase stamina regen during storms. Increase meat yield. Increase stamina. That might be a good one too. Move speed while crouching. Bone yield when skinning. Okay, so I'm guessing we have to get one or more of these to unlock what's below it. Turn wood into sticks. I'm guessing that's going to be important. Use the coverage penalty. I'm thinking that's going to be good. No, that's going to be good. 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 <laughs> Exotics, I don't know what an exotic is. I don't know if that's so good yet. But this movement speed one up here is good too. So for now though, we're gonna go with the carrying capacity. It's like you can't go wrong with being able to carry more stuff, right? And that movement speed one looks really nice too. Turning wood into sticks, like there's sticks everywhere. I mean, is that actually gonna be important? I don't know why they'd put that in there unless it actually was important, but you know, I don't know. You never know. I wonder how deep I'm going to have to go in here to actually be detected from these storms that I'm holding about. Don't fall on me, Rack. That's the last thing I need. <laughs> this is so ghetto. I can barely get in here. Deep enough in. I'm gonna assume this is deep enough in, and if a storm comes up and I need to, I'll just, I guess, make it deeper. 
pretty far back in the rock. Wow, probably not real far, but fairly far. Okay, how many rocks do I have? I got a hundred. So how do I make a stone pile? It said I could make a stone pile. Okay. What, do I craft a stone pile, maybe? Stone pile, yeah, apparently I do. Okay. Oh, this stuff is rotting. Huh. How do I eat it? I need some water and I need some oxygen. How do I get oxygen? I got this stuff. Can refine refine this uh, into breathable oxygen. Okay, how do I use it? Stable water oxygen matrix. Oxide slowly decomposes when exposed. So I just put this. Oh, okay, yeah. Apparently, I just put it in there. All right, and then water. I just go over to the water and drink. Right. Oxygen is slowly going up. Alright, so he told me to just get make a hole in there and then start uh, cutting trees. So I guess I'm going to go start cutting some trees. Huh? Wait a second. So this is about to break. Is there a way to like fix it? Right-click to repair. Oh, and it repairs it to full. Nice. Okay. I like it. Get our axe out here. We'll just... I guess I don't get to cut the little trees. Pick them up with my hand. Okay, and I'm cut cutting the trees down. Timber. Yeah, okay, it looks like I cut it up. Nice little boards here. Yeah, there is more, but I thought there was. See, we're getting plenty of sticks from the trees. Cool, we only got two pieces of wood for now. But I'm not sure we need to actually turn sticks into wood. Like, I'm wondering, kind of wondering why that's even a thing. Quite a bit of wood out of one tree. It does take a little bit of time. Oh yeah, we make that knife now, can't we? Uh, how do I open that? Inventory, crafting, stone throwing knife, stone knife. Hmm. Twenty-five to twenty-eight projectile, forty-five to fifty melee. Hundred percent yield from skinning. Let's make this one. Okay, so now we have a way to defend ourselves. We're getting slowed down here. Is that because we're heavy? Play. Okay. There, that's better. Now we're not heavy. <coughs> we're low on oxygen again. I just put that stuff in there. How much of this do we does it have to put in there? Want to have to go hunt that stuff down too? Yeah. 
both games it's E to pick stuff up, but in this game it's F for some reason. I can't believe he told me just level by cutting wood and mining stone until I could get make wood houses. Like seriously, is this how long is this gonna take? Sure, I'm almost level two, but it looks like it's getting uh, more and more XP per level, so I imagine it's gonna be a while. I also imagine you guys are not gonna want me to uh, play whole episodes of just picking up wood, right? Other level. Yeah, I don't know about this game for a series. If it's just all this gathering, I'm not sure how much you guys would enjoy that. I don't know, you tell me. You want more of it, you don't want more of it, it's up to you guys. It isn't a good looking game, though. And I'm assuming at some point we're actually going to fight stuff and kill stuff. And... Uh, we're going to need to go get some more of this oxygen stuff, man. We're going through that stuff like crazy. How much of that are we going to need? Okay, let's see. Did I find some around here somewhere? Pretty sure I saw some over here. Yeah. I ain't like I did the stone at least. I hope this stuff's everywhere. Stamina. Man, that improved stamina one might be good. I need to breathe. Uh, is that a Komodo dragon? Kind of looks like it. There's a leopard over there. Huh. What do you think? Should I try it? I do have a knife now. He's level 29, I'm level 2. Okay. I don't know how well that'll go, but... Oh. Honestly, though, we are getting hungry. Maybe Komodo Dragon's meat we need. We're going to have to try it, I think. Wait, 4 is my knife? Wait, can I fight with my axe? How does this work? 27 to 30, 45 to 50. Yeah, we're fighting with the knife, man. Come here, Komodo Dragon. I'm hungry. Wait, how do I hit him? There we go. That wasn't so bad. Okay, after skin. My knife is broken already. Wow, okay. So how do I... I go to inventory, then I go down here. Can I repair it? Okay, apparently I can repair it. And then... The pick. Yeah, to get his bones. I think we're definitely going to want that bone knife. That knife is awesome. More oxygen? Come on, guys. That's my only way to get oxygen. I'm going to go crazy fast. I can tell you that. I don't want to spend half my time just breaking apart these oxide things to get oxygen. 
I'm assuming at some point there's going to be a more efficient way to do it. Assuming. Look at that. It's barely filled me up and it's used that much. Five of them already. Showers, weather event, minor showers approaching. Oh, I'm heavy. Encumbered. Okay. Trying to get to our rock before the storms hit. I think that's our rock there. What did I do? I set that pile down somewhere. No, that's not a rock. That must be a rock. Okay, so I set wood down too, I get. I have to craft. Wood pile craft. At 379. Two hundred wood to pile. No. There we go. puts it in separate hot bar slots. Storm exposure. Block the storm? No, it doesn't. Great. No shelter. Wait, I can't use a pickaxe in a storm? Oh, okay. See, now I'm out of the storm. All I had to do was break a little more up, I guess. How long does these storms last, I wonder? Ooh, a wolf. I need to get my knife out. Kill me a wolf. I need to eat. I probably should cook that Komodo dragon, actually. I wonder if I could put my little build a fire pit in here, actually. Twenty fur for a bed roll. Go wolf hunting. All right, I got three more points here. So, do I want the spear? Forty-nine to fifty-five. Forty-five to fifty. Man, that's like the same as the knife. Okay, that requires level five. I don't want that. I think. Hammer. Tain or upgrade your structure. Probably gonna want that too. Orch. Probably gonna want that. Alright. Balanced. Let's go with some more carrying capacity. I've already been covered several times. Now, can I put that fire pit down here? Put it in here. Right there, you know. Have to interact. Uh, let's see, I got two raw meats. I have to put them in its inventory. 
Okay, and then activate it. Requires fuel. Of course it does. Some wood there. Okay. Now we're talking. How do I know when it's done? Does it just go in my inventory or? What's this? Cocoa seed? I can plant coffee trees? <laughs> I don't know, apparently. Okay, so we got one raw meat, one cooked. 20 health and we consume 100 food. Okay, we're hungry. So. Yeah, we filled about half of our gut up. We're gonna need this other one too. We're gonna have to go kill some stuff. We're gonna go kill some stuff pretty fast. We gotta get water again already. Man, just getting oxygen, food, and water is gonna take an enormous amount of time. Two. Okay. Charcoal. I don't know what we're gonna need charcoal for, but I'm taking it. And we'll turn the fire off. Don't want to burn our rock down. All right. So let's see. We are going to need to find something to kill. Get a knife out. Where was that wolf went? Hear something. Oh. Hey, how is this looking for you? We took a lot of damage there. Burr, okay, we got some burr for our bedroll. Another weather pack? Come on, guys. You're killing me. Let me get some water first, at least. Man, this game is rough, isn't it? So I don't have time to do anything. I just can't even get in here now because of the fire pit. Buddy. Man. Is that really necessary? Frick. Level up already, okay. Keep getting out of the storm, but in order to do that, I need to get inside my rock. What is this? Overflow bag? Okay. Alright, we're inside now. Put our pit back down. Is there just not enough room out here? Is that what it is? Lighting is there, okay. Ugh. Oh, put the wood back in. Yeah. Put our meat in. Ooh, we got five meat this time. That's good. Okay, so what are these? Wild berries. Those. Yeah. Give me some water, I guess. Something's trying to get me. Let's smell my food. Getting kind of low on health, so I need to eat. Hey, what up? Is 
that thing breaking through the wall? It is. Alright, well. You're dying. Wait. Attack. Oh, my knife's broke. Yeah, buddy. Oh, I died. Hmm. So I did lose. Do I lose all my stuff? This is, uh, I don't know. It's kind of fun. It's kind of cool. And it's also kind of annoying. I'm not sure what I'm thinking about this so far. Old F to respawn. It drops me down again. I hope I'm somewhere close to my stuff. I think I was over here somewhere. I think. Don't quote me on that. Over, okay. Komodo. I don't have any weapons. Leave me alone, Komodo. Where was I? It was up here somewhere, right? Yeah, I think I'm completely lost already. I wish it put a marker on the map. Maybe that's it. Maybe that's my body. I thought that was actually the pod we came down in. shelter. A wolf better be gone. Take all. Okay. Wow. Alright. Do I still have meat cooking? I don't need it now, but I'm wondering. That's exactly way to keep this stuff cooking up. I'm going to repair these, I think. And what I guess just keep chopping down wood until I get attacked by something else. I actually have food. Wait, how much oxygen do I have? Oh, I'm out of that oxygen stuff already. Stuff goes quick. I guess I better get some more of that stuff. stamina quickly. So I'm told there's like armor and stuff that you can get later on. There's obviously better weapons, armor, you know, won't get killed by every random thing. There's bows. Once we have bows, we can probably kill stuff in the distance. So there's all kinds of cool stuff we can do. But it obviously just takes levels and unlocking this stuff. Uh, 
game stacks up to 50 apparently. Getting awful dark. I don't know how dark dark is in this game. Did spec into a torch. Wait. Did spec into a torch, so we have a torch. Or we can make a torch. Other one here for the night, maybe? Want any health regeneration? I wondered if it's smart to actually cook all this stuff. I'm thinking I probably should have built that dryer and dried it. I don't know. See, they're rotting, like, in my inventory. I'm betting they're rotting over here already. I'm wondering how long it's going to take. Oh, 1,436 seconds, obviously. So I probably shouldn't have cooked these. I probably should have waited until they were almost rotten and then cooked them. And then they would have lasted longer. That would have made sense. Got too late now, though. Alright, so it looks like we're just hanging in here for the night, probably. I can make a torch, but I'm not sure if I want to walk around out there with a torch and draw every animal to me. Uh, let's see. Crafting. Torch. How many of these should I make? I don't say. Well, we don't have that much fiber. Guess we're making four. <coughs> That's the question. If we have these in our hand, do we can we... Yeah, we can put them there. Okay, how do we actually use that? Uh... I don't know, guys. So, uh... I'm going to end this episode here. I'm going to do a little looking up stuff online. We'll probably do at least one more episode of this. But I'll look stuff up online. One, I'll figure out how to use this torch. But uh, I'll see you guys in the next episode. You made it this far. Don't forget to like the video. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel, guys. And I will see you in the next one. So have a good one.